Hi everyone, in this video we're going to look at how gravity produces electromagnetism, which is considered one of the fundamental forces of nature, which produces electric fields, magnetic fields, and light, and is especially known to be in figure 8 flow patterns, such as this. Now, gra gravity is the force exerted on an object by another, which is an inverse of radius squared and a function of their masses. Now, how this produces electromagnetism requires the infinite fractal universe to be considered. So, the moon orbits the Earth, which orbits the sun, which orbits the supermassive black hole at the center of the Milky Way, and from this pattern, we can infer that this should continue larger and larger all the way towards infinite. And just the same, let's say this is an atom here, it should grow infinitely smaller towards the infinitesimal. And from this structure plus gravity, we can determine how electromagnetism is produced. So when the infinitesimal orbits the quote infinite even at the speed of light it cannot escape the force of gravity and is pulled back towards the center of mass and rather than crashing into the surface it travels through the body alike to a neutrino traveling through the earth when it reaches the surface and so this produces the orbital pattern of a figure eight flow pattern of the infinitesimal through the infinite. So when infinite infinitesimal particles travel in this figure eight pattern, all having slightly varied masses, all of which we cannot observe the difference of because they are so infinitesimal, the summation of the flow of all particles is what produces the electromagnetic field. And this is why rotation is essential for magnetism because it assists in bending particles off of a direct pattern away from the object, and thus this allows for the particles to be pulled by the force of gravity back towards the center of mass, otherwise it would just continue away because the gravity is balanced. For more information on how gravity produces many other observations that are key to the current models in physics, you can see the full video and the explanation of how all observations reduce to being the result of gravity in the video Theory of Everything, the Universal Principle of Natural Philosophy, which can be found at this link here. Thanks for watching.